Paul Wright, and welcome back to a brand new episode of Andy Cade. My name's Andy, as always, and today we're playing the game that I've wanted to play for a long time, and especially do it do a Let's Play of, and that's Undertale. So we'll get to the there it is, Undertale. <laughs> okay. All right. So anyway, like I was saying, um, I've wanted to play this game for a long time. I've seen a lot of people do um, playthroughs of it. I've seen uh, Commander Holly's playthrough of it, Game Grumps playthrough of it on Steam Train, I've seen Jack Septicai's playthrough, uh, I've seen Super Beard Bros playthrough. <laughs> Hell, I think even Markiplier may have touched on the game at some point, maybe. I don't know for sure. But anyway, I've seen those a lot of playthroughs of this game, so I kind of know what's going to happen, so you know, I don't have to worry about spoiling anything with me, you know. I'm in the know about these things. But still, I wanted to play this game and show you guys on Andycade, because, to tell you the truth, this is the game that really got me back into Let's Playing, and just kind of got me back into the idea of, eh, I should probably get this whole Let's Play thing another try. So, um, now before we begin, though, I do want to sit down and, and talk to you a little bit. Um, there were some technical errors with the, uh, with part one of this playthrough, which is what you're watching now. Um, so the video game capture footage, uh, was all glitchy and stuff, so rather than just scrap the entire playthrough, I just, I decided to just re-record the first episode, so I'll basically just get up to, uh, the part where, uh, right before episode two takes over, so, um, I'm gonna go from there, and, uh, that's why you're seeing me with a black shirt. In this, uh, in this episode, and then 2 through 7, I'm going to be in a red shirt and all that other stuff. So hopefully that won't ruin the continuity for you. But, um, yeah, I just wanted to re-record it because, you know, technical difficulties. <laughs> and I've already tried re-recording this, actually, but my uh, uh, voice capture, the SD card, didn't capture everything because I guess it filled up because all my other Let's Plays and stuff that I did before this. So, but anyway, I'm rambling on, so let's begin. A name has already been chosen. Oh, blah, blah, blah. Hey, there I am. Just a booping around. What's up here? Nothing? No? Okay. Alrighty. Let's move on down to the underground. Hey, who's this guy? Don't you have anything better to do? So, yeah, like I said, I've already done the playthrough before, so some of the dialogue's gonna be a little different, like here. <laughs> so. Anyway, see that heart? That is your soul, the very culmination of your being. And I can move my soul around. Neo! Your soul starts off weak, but can grow strong if you gain a lot of LV. What's LV stand for? Why, love, of course. You want some love, don't you? Don't worry, I'll share some with you. Down here, love is shared through little white friendliness pellets. Are you ready? Move around, get as many as you can. Ah, shit, I missed. Hey, buddy, you missed them. Let's try again, okay? Ah, uh, yeah. I'm really bad at this game. This is this a joke? Are you brain dead? Run into the bullets. Friendly spells. Ah, shit. Oh, dang it. I fucked up. You know what's going on here, don't you? You just wanted to see me suffer. Well, shit. Die. On you! Oh no! Ha! Are they? Go mom! I mean, go mom! Sorry, spoiled it ahead of time. What a terrible creature, torturing such a poor innocent youth. Ah, uh, do not be afraid, my child. I am Toriel, caretaker of the ruins. I pass through this place every day to see if anyone has fallen down. You are the first human to come here in a long time. Come, I will guide you through the catacombs. This way. Okay. 
I, li I like how, like, as I move, she moves a little bit. If I don't move, and she just, like, stops and's like, Hey, what are you waiting for? What are you waiting for? I'm gonna go this way. See what happens. Ah, dang it. She moves so fast. Okay. Alright, what now? Welcome to your new home, innocent one. Allow me to educate you in the operation of the ruins. Oh, okay, that's easy. The ruins are full of puzzles. Ancient fusions between diversions and door keys. One must solve them to move from room to room. Please adjust yourself to the sight of them. Okay, so it's like do 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 and then do. Okay, got it. To make progress here, you will need to trigger several switches. Do not worry, I have labeled the ones that you need to flip. Uh, okay. Huh. I think it's that one. Yeah. I, I just, oh, oh, there's text next to it. Pretty, please press. Wow, I didn't know that. Oh, I don't get a click, it's just like a, all right, he, he gets it. Or she, I don't know the gender of this person. Eh, yeah. splendid, I am proud of you, little one. Let us move to the next room. What does this guy do? The switch doesn't even work. Ah. As a human living in the underground, monsters may attack you. You will need to be prepared for this situation. However, worry not. The process is simple. When you encounter a monster, you will enter a fight. While you are in a fight, strike up a friendly conversation. Stall for time, I will come to resolve the conflict. Practice talking to the dummy. Okay. Hey, dummy. How you doing? I encountered the dummy! What do I do? I uh, talk. I talk to the dummy. Doesn't seem much for conversation. Toro seems happy with you, though. I won! But I didn't get XP or gold. Did I really win? Ah, very good. You are very good. That's nice to know. There is another puzzle in this room. I wonder if you can solve it. Okay. Mm Maybe it's here. Nope. 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 No. What? What? Uh, where is it? Lead the way, goat mom. Meow, 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 meow. This. Oh. It's a frog it! What do I do? Uh, maybe I can compliment. Okay. Frog didn't understand what I said, but was flattered anyway. Oh shit! <laughs> Dang! Toriel giving him a stare down. That's right, you walk away. <laughs> Alright, is this a puzzle? Western room is the Eastern room's blueprint. Uh, it's not much of a puzzle. Where's the buttons? Where's the switches? What do I do, Go Mom? Help! This is the puzzle, bud. Here, take my hand for a moment. Aw. <laughs> See, little moments like this, little, little extra touches is why I love this game. There's like little stuff like this. It's, it's nice, it's cute, it's adorable. It makes me go, aw. <laughs> Puzzles seem a little too dangerous for now. Oh. You have done excellently thus far, my child. However, I have a difficult request to ask of you. I would like you to walk to the end of the room by yourself. Forgive me for this. Oh god, I gotta walk. Why am I not walking fast? I gotta catch up to go, Mom. Don't leave me. The music got all ominous. I don't know what's gonna happen. What if I stay off the beaten path? Maybe there's some over here. Okay. Oh no! What do I do? What do I do? Dosho! I don't know. What's back here? Ellipses. How about up here? More ellipses. What do I do? Oh man. Oh man. Ah! Greetings, my child. 
Do not worry, I did not leave you. I was merely behind this pillar the whole time. Thank you for trusting me. However, there is an important reason for this exercise. To test your independence. I must attend to some business, and you must stay alone for a while. Please remain here. It's dangerous to explore by yourself. <laughs> I thought she was going to say, it's dangerous to go alone. I have an idea. I'll give you a cell phone. Because I know when that hotline bling. It can only mean one thing. If you have a need for anything, just call. Be good, alright? You used to call me on your cell phone late at night when you need my love. Or LV. <laughs> Ring. Hello? This is Toriel. You have not left the room, have you? Nope, still in the room. I mean, technically. There are a few puzzles ahead that I've yet to explain. It would be dangerous to try and solve them yourself. Be good, alright? Hmm. Okie dokie. Boop, 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 boop. Ah! Froggit hopped close. Too close! You're too close, Froggit. I say something nice. You understand what I said? I was flattered anyway. He blushes deeply. Okay, let's avoid these guys. Okay. He seems reluctant to fight me. Okay. Oh, cool. So when they're uh, knit, when the the text is in yellow, that means you can spare them. So you go there to mercy, spare. Hey, I got two gold. Nice. That's what I like. Oh shit. Oh, another frog had hopped close. Let's compliment. Didn't understand what I said. I was flattered anyway. Oh man. So much. Okay. Froggit seemed reluctant to fight you. Spare. Yep. Hello? This is Toriel. For no reason in particular, which do you prefer? Cinnamon or butterscotch? Wait. Do not tell me. Is it butterscotch? Well. I like both of them actually, because I do like the little Werther's caramel butterscotch candies. Um, I like cinnamon. Cinnamon goes good with a lot of things. Mm. Eh, I'll go with butterscotch. Why not? Hehe, <laughs> I had a feeling. When humans fall down here, strangely, I often feel like I've already know them. Truthfully, when I first saw you, I felt. Like I was seeing an old friend for the first time. Strange, is it not? Well, thank you for your selection. Okay then. Oh. Hello, this is Toriel. You do not dislike cinnamon, do you? I know what your preference is, but would you turn up your nose if you found it on your plate? Right, right. I understand. Thank you for being patient, by the way. Okay, what's up here? Three out of four gray rocks recommend you push them. Are you one of the three or four? Oh, oh no. Frog had hopped close. What if I threaten him? Frog didn't understand what I said, but was scared anyway. Shiver, shiver. Okay, that doesn't really... He seems reluctant to fight. Okay. I still got the same thing. Alright, so you're one of the four rocks. Or three of the four rocks. Okay. Let's go here. See if I remember how to do this. I think, it, I think it's this, 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 this. Oh! Damn it, went too far. Yep, yeah, same. So I've done this puzzle before, so... Oh. Farga hopped close again. Let's compliment. Hey, he's flattered anyway. Blushes deeply. Okay. All right. Cool. Anyway, let's move on. I think it was here, and then you go up a little bit there, and it's like there. Uh, I think it's 
here, and then here, and then here. Yeah! I got it. Oh no, there's three rocks. Oh, good. Tripped into a line of mold smoles. That's a lot of them. Oh, I can spare them all. Jeez Louise, okay. Spare. I didn't get anything. Dang it. Okay. Let's get this guy. Then we gonna get this guy. Whoa there, partner. Who said you could push me around? Hmm? So you're asking me to move over. Okay, just for you, pumpkin. Eh, I'll need a little more than that. Hmm? You want me to move some more? Alrighty, how's this? Hey, <laughs> we both moved! How, how's that possible? Huh? That was the wrong direction. Okay, think I got it. Yeah, good job, Rock. Hey, was you? Why'd you do that? Mm -hmm. You wanted me to stay there? You're giving me a real workout. It. Frog and Wimson drew near. Alright, I'll spare Wimson. And then endure the wrath of the frog. It. Okay. He hopped to and fro. Let's compliment. Dinner soon says, flattered anyway. And he blushes deeply. That's nice. And he seems reluctant, so spare. Only got two gold. Lame. Anyway. Okay. We're just gonna move on. Alrighty. I wonder who this ghost could be. Okay. I think that about calls it for an episode of Andy Cade. With that said, this is the Andy Son. Sign up for now. Thanking you guys poop, for tuning in to this episode of Andy Cade. And I hope you continue to tune in for my playthrough of Undertale. And as always, I will see you in the next video. Bye bye!